two times going down, it's one time on the circle going up. I would recommend a ram mount that goes up here for when this thing comes back, that it sits on that so it doesn't bounce when you're going down the road. See, like, right, boom, like that. See, it can do that if you don't have one of them ram mounts. So the main motor, just turn the key, and at low voltage, it needs to be run probably because it, radar is the first thing to come out, to go out, it's warming up. So then batteries, I would check them uh, or run it for a while and see if they keep up. But about five years, your batteries are toast. That's just the way it is. So I'm gonna go to combos, go back, go to sonar, go to this, and I'm gonna go back into this one, go home, go to do a radar, that's warming up. So I'm gonna tap this, go back, so when that warms up, I'm gonna have a little thing up there that says transmit radar. So now that I'm deployed there, then you hit this check mark and that shuts this off. Shutting down, there you go. Okay, this here is for the lights up underneath here. That's what this is for. So I'm gonna take this and this, since we're done with it. I'm gonna take this, put it up in here like this. Take this, since I'm done using it, Put it up under here, put it back in there. Now that I'm done with this, I'm gonna shut it off, just push this. And then a ram out, you'd lock it so it just stays there. So yeah, this boat's a dandy. I mean, it's like brand spanking new. It's got some little scratches on the side, but I mean, holy cow, look at the price of a new one. Okay, then I hit this radar right here. Spinning up. And Garmin's are really fast. There, you got your dual uh, dual range radar. So if I change this one, it doesn't change this one over here. And you can see the separation. Here's a pi the pylons around the bridge. Boom, boom. And that's where you'd want to go dead center up there. And it's about 77. It depends on what angle you're coming in. But typically about 75, 77 will take you underneath the bridge. And then you go to 90 degrees. Say this went out if you had a compass. Then you go to 144, and then you do 175, then 180. We'll take you right back to the dock. Okay, full tank of gas. So I think you got a winner. 52 hours. Oh, then what we're going to do, just so you know, there's your speed right here. Then I can go up here, go home, AVG helm, vessels, course over ground, and speed. So now I want to make sure I got everything so I ain't going to fly all over the place. So 1,001, 1,002, 1,000, about three seconds to plane. Now, I'm not using the trim tabs. Really, if it's like this, don't use them. You're just burning up fuel. I'm gonna start trimming the motor first, and that even helps. See 78 degrees? Right here, I do about 80. And then as soon as I hear them cars, I switch it to 100. The 90s right over here. Then the 100s on the other side of the range markers. Right there. Then I'd run about, at this speed, I'd run about maybe 40 seconds. And then I'd go to 140 on my GPS compass. Like right there. I'd probably go 140. Or I could just go off of my charts right here. But back. There, 140, go charge. Then I run this way for about a minute. 39 miles an hour. Then normally they leave this light on over here. So once they do that, I go to 175. And that's the way if there's a ship up here, I'll, I'll miss them coming in. And when I bypass, I'll see the silhouette. Then I can just go 180 and it'll take me right in. See? And the dog is right there. Okay. That's all I got for you guys. You got a winner, man. Very nice boat. Everything works great. Uh, but you do have like a low draw on the battery. Maybe they need a low test them just to make sure. Uh, again, batteries last about five years. And that's it. Yeah, this smells just a jumping. That was actually bigger than I smelled, though. That was a pretty good size fish there.
Huh, I'm further than a Springer. A Law Springer. Okay, anyway, to turn them off, you just hit this one right here. Uh, disable your backlight, all that good stuff. Just hold it. It's going to shut off. Now, this one here, you want to make sure you go into, uh, like, say, radar first. Just hit the dual range. You want to make sure you shut that radar off. Then you hit this, and then you hit power, and it will shut this one on turn off system. Okay, so that's all I got for you, buddy. And they fixed the trim cam sensor. That's working. Yeah, nice boat. Nice boat. You can steer with your trim tabs, just so you know. We're down at the bottom. That's good. It idles good. No hesitation. Uh, corrosion extra seat bases. It will keep them looking like new instead of rusting on you. And this is the boat doctor out. I'll shut you down here if I can find the right boat.